In this video tutorial, you'll learn how to add magnifying zoom for images in WordPress. Adding a magnifying zoom for images in a WordPress website improves user experience by enabling users to view fine details, enhancing the visual appeal, and aiding better product evaluation for e-commerce sites. Now, to get started with this video, you need to install the WP Image Zoom plugin. I've already installed and activated it, but if you need help installing a plugin, then we have a video where you can learn that as well. I'll link the video in the description below, or you can also click on the eye icon in the top right corner of your screen to view the video. Now, let's configure the plugin by simply clicking on WP Image Zoom in the sidebar. Here you can choose from circle, square, and zoom window lens shapes. You can even select a no lens or X option if you don't want to use a shape for magnifying effect. You can preview an image with the selected lens to see how it works. The plugin offers a preview image that you can use to test your changes. On scrolling, you can configure some other settings as well. You can select the cursor type from here. You can adjust various other settings offered by this plugin. You can access various other tabs here as per your need. Once everything's in place, don't forget to save the changes. Now, moving next to the General tab, you find more relative settings here, which you can configure, like enabling zoom on various devices, etc. You can access more settings as per your need. Once done, don't forget to save changes. Now, let's test the plugin. Move to Posts and hover over All Posts. I'll simply edit an existing post. Let's add an image to this post first to see the plugin in action. Let me add an image here. And once done, you can find the zoom settings under the Style tab on the right. Simply select it. And you can see the zoom effect has been applied to this image. You can now go back to your site's front end and check the changes. This is how easy it is to add magnifying zoom for images in WordPress. That's it for today's video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button. If you're new to our channel, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so you don't miss any of our future videos. Thanks for watching. We'll see you at the next one.